What is up my frosty brethren? My name is Arctic. Today is Thursday. That means it's Gears of War discussion day. Disclaimer, this is old Gears of War gameplay from the amazing channel. And disclaimer, let's get started, shall we? Uh, so today, uh, you know, I want to talk about the Gears of War Ultimate Edition. There was a lot of folks that uh, sent me messages and and YouTube comments and tweets. I got pulled into a couple uh, Gears conversations about uh, the leaked footage that we sh we saw where the player is shooting uh, on canals in the Gears of War Ultimate Edition or Remaster, whatever it's going to be called. If you haven't seen that footage, link is in the description. Link save lives. Check the description if you guys have not seen this leaked uh, gameplay and you want to watch it. Uh, there was a big, huge uh email that went out from uh vmc to this group and that's part of the article that i'm linking you to uh, it's on polygon and basically those testers that leaked that info got in trouble i think there's a lawsuit against them right now it's pretty serious business um needless to say um they leaked the gameplay there was like an xbox clip from upload studio uploaded to the person's account stupid um and some people got a, a, a sniff of that and they, they basically uh, found out and then people started reposting that. And then there was a couple videos on YouTube. Obviously, screenshots have been coming out. A lot of speculation on whether the remaster was actually happening from folks that didn't either see previous footage or just didn't believe the leaks that were coming out. A lot of skepticism overall. And I think for the most part, a lot of it has been um, silenced. You should believe that there's a remaster coming, although Microsoft is still not officially an uh, announced it. It seems all but clear that this is a thing since all those folks now have lawsuits against them from Microsoft. So uh, it seems legit. And, um, you know, I from the gameplay footage I saw is on canals. It looks different. Um, you know, I, I it was difficult to tell if um you know some 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 of the mechanics are a little different if it's uh, how how early in the beta that is uh if we're actually going to see this thing uh this year i don't know but needless to say the game uh definitely looked gears ish uh didn't the, some of the sounds the audio cue sounded a little different um and that that kind of bothered me a little bit one of the the debates that uh, some folks uh, decided to pull me into a little bit, uh, and I kind of, kind of got into it myself. But uh, center screen firing, you know, for those that did not play Gears of War One, the original OG game, uh, you actually fired center screen, and Gears Two and Three, you fired from the barrel. Uh, so, you know, when Judgment came out, there's a lot of folks that were kind of upset or didn't actually understand where they were firing from. And Judgment actually used a kind of a different system where it fired from the barrel to the center screen. Uh, but for all intents and purposes, 95 percent, 99 percent of the people that, um, you know, basically are trying to understand it for the most part. All you need to know is that it shot from center screen. So it's more like Gears of War one then gears two or gears three when you were lining up targets that were in front of you now if they got all up on your on your uh barrel then it's gonna shoot them from there but needless to say uh there's some questions around what you know where the gun that this was a nasher shot where it was fired from and i got pulled into that discussion and uh you know some interesting stuff back and forth i i'm kind of curious to see what people think is better there's always a lot of arguments and people frustrated about one or the other because they've been playing gears 3 for so long and they've been playing gears 2 for so long or whatever if you're an og you play gears 1 and then you went to gears 2 and then you went to gears 3 you just adapt it to you know whatever uh the firing mechanisms were and and you went about your business other folks that had a harder time adjusting i noticed they they tend to complain about one way or the other so you know there's always going to be with this game and this is what i think bothers me the most about uh just having franchise titles in general is that there's so much constant back and forth about what is better what's worse and uh you know it makes it very difficult i think to assess what are the right decisions for the franchise because you keep iterating on a game so you know i'm looking forward to see what the response is to uh ultimate edition it definitely looked different it looked better in terms of visuals it looked definitely looked a lot crisper clean 
I, I liked uh, the look of the game. I am curious about the mechanics, what's what's under the hood. Once we get that, um, you know, I think we'll have a better picture of where uh, this remaster is going to land. And hopefully, again, it comes out here soon i mean i we're we're approaching what six months basically we're going to be into that holiday season so i'm i'm speculating that it's going to come out in that <clears throat> excuse me in that time frame and if it doesn't uh you know i'm going to be curious as to when they plan on releasing this thing because at that point i think we're going to get into the new gears of war uh, gears of war 4 whatever black tusk is developing and that could uh potentially kind of stomp on some of that fun potentially i don't know but, uh, you know, it, it'll be interesting, again, like I said, to play Gears of War on the Xbox One, have some old school uploads coming in. Uh, but, you know, I'm going to reserve a lot of uh, discussion about it until we see more of the game, which I'm hoping is at E3. Very curious as to what you guys uh, think about it so far. Leave your comments down in the comment section. Did you like the footage that you saw? Uh, come back to the video if you have not seen it and then leave a comment about your reaction. Definitely, definitely curious. And uh, until the next time, folks, I will catch you all later. Stay frosty. If you like this video, you should probably click on the one down below. That'll take you to another video. You may like it. A little bit about me. I'm a former pro player. I play PC and console, mostly shooters. I also have a gaming podcast. I do tips and tactics, live gameplays. Check out my Twitch. Also, I work in the industry. Why are you not subscribed?